we'll begin the show today from the red carpet premiere of the Hollywood action movie screening Bullet Train in Lagos, Southwest Nigeria. Nigerian celebrities, including reality television stars, actors, and other filmmakers, turn up as the new Brad Pitt action driven movie arrives to Nigerian theaters. This should be fun. <laughs> Although Nollywood movies are currently the toast of many Nigerian theatres, the classic Hollywood bang-bang-bang action genre still enjoys good followership. And it's no surprise to see some Nigerian celebrities join other movie lovers for the premiere screening of Brad Pitt's new action thriller, Bullet Train. Attending the premiere were actor Sheyo Awolowo, singer turned movie director Dr. Sid, reality television star Esther, Tricky T, Nelson, and a host of others. I see a lot of creators that use green screen. You know, um, I see a creator like Chinaza, she uses green screen. I see other creators as well that use green screen. And I feel like they're going to pioneer us into the future of our production. When you can use it properly, you can bring a lot of things to life, a whole lot of things to life. And I feel that is what Nollywood has always missed out on. I think only Ratnik was able to do, use it, but with how acclaimed and accepted it was, you know that the future is bright when you have bigger budgets. With Amazon coming, with Netflix already here, there will definitely be a budget for action movies. The movie follows a comic chain of events around an unlucky assassin, determined to do his job peacefully after one too many gigs gone off the rails. Fate, however, may have other plans as his latest mission put him on a collision course with lethal adversaries from around the globe, all with connected yet conflicting objectives on the world's fastest train. Talk to me. I am ready. You are getting the new and improved me. Because if you put peace out in the world, you get peace back. I think you might be forgetting what you do for a living. Take the job. Oh, yeah. I think it depends on the story, how compelling the story is, and how easy it is. I don't really like action movies that have so much complexity. You know, if it's simple, if the story is compelling, if it gets me on the edge every single time, then count me in. Yeah. So I think for Nigerian um, filmmakers, one thing that I think that like you know they should borrow is to leave to leave like a bit of mystery to the movie. So I've seen the trailer for Bullet Train. I know there's supposed to be action, but I know that apart from the action, there's like some other some other things that you know that that go to. Through, um, through me in the movie. So unlike the Nigerian movie, when you watch the, the trailer, you already know what's going to happen from the beginning to, to the end. So just keep a, little, just keep a, a bit of mystery. Oh, no, no, thank you. You know what? Do you have um, anything sparkling? That's the one. Thank you. Domo arigato. Sure you want to talk this out? Not particularly, no. Uh, okay. Bullet Train is directed by David Litch, who is also director of Deadpool 2. 